these are the artifacts. Yeah. Here are all the artifacts. Deep in the jungles of Misiones, Daniel Shovelzahn has granted Tim Kennedy and Alasdair Brooks access to his base camp, the home for thousands of artifacts Daniel has uncovered from the four structures that make up this Nazi jungle hideout. This is from all the sites you've been working yes, on? Yes, absolutely all came from inside the site. Finding the two-story building is significant. We need to find clues in these artifacts that will tell me who the people are that were using it and what they were doing here. How many artifacts have you found in your excavation work? For the moment, over 4,000 fragments and items, but we keep digging. As you'd likely expect, my eyes are caught by the oh. ceramics. <laughs> yeah, you're an expert on that. This one's particularly interesting to me. A gravy boat in the middle of the jungle? That suggests a certain level of dining activity. And these structures are in the middle of nowhere. Why would you have a level of formal dining, a level of that aspiration to gentility in these households? I don't think there's any question that anybody could doubt that somebody was prepared to stay here for as long as they wanted and could feel safe. This is particularly interesting because it has a German maker's mark. That's Villeroy and Bosch. If I were to find this in, say, Buenos Aires, I might not be too surprised. Here in Misiones, on the banks of the Paraná River, in these sites that are complex of sites that are hidden away, that's more remarkable. This is highly breakable, highly fragile materials made in Germany. Accepting that Hitler's style of living was higher end, there is connection, an unexpected level of formal dining here in the jungle. This doesn't look like somebody is there to hide. This is like somebody is there to live comfortably. There's not sufficient evidence that Hitler died in the bunker in April 30th, 1945. Could Adolf Hitler have gotten out of Berlin and how did he do it? How did he enter Argentina? We're gonna look at who could facilitate hiding Hitler. 